Hey, you didn't moonwalk run. Shiny thing. This is the best upgrade. That was actually a very subtle foreshadowing. Oh, cool, yeah. Uh, it said very briefly, probably out getting Pokemon or something. That alludes to Mirabee's uh, use later on in the game. Alrighty, here at the Research Institute, ready to purify Handauer. Yay, charm! Not charming in the slightest. So, while I'm at it, I am uh, going to mess with the sets, but you don't have to watch me do that. Alrighty, that's all sorted out. And uh, while I was at it, I also grabbed an item from Voltorb and Numel, uh, just because I could, and also because Voltorb was holding a magnet. Boost electric moves. Find that slightly more useful than the black glasses. Numel had a charcoal. Nah, I don't have any fire moves at this point. So. And off we go to Pyrite. So my party shadow Pokemon are uh, currently kind of getting close to purification. I may have to duck out either for those or for uh, Poke Spot stuff. In which case, I'll try to minimize uh, traveling footage. And there was a guy out front before. Oh, there he is. Well, that's just it. They didn't even take the shroom. Wasted potential there. Anyway, we got ninjas, we got crazy stuff. Had a Carvana and a Barboach. Nothing too notable. Hi guys, I'm totally a criminal, I'm going to kill you. Or not. Do you have any knife? Ah! We have a catch. You guys can wait. So I will see you at the Pokespot. Hey, here at the Rock Pokespot, we have a wild sand shrew that we can attempt to snag. Although it's not really snagging anymore, it's catching. I'm gonna have to rework my brain. Anyway, these are the only single battles left in the game, so you better cherish them. And there's also an overabundance of ground types when it comes to these. So, unfortunately, Thunder Wave won't be getting too much use. Normal quick attacks is... I, I want to use Bite here. I'm not going to be catching all the Poke Spot Pokemon. That was an accident. But it's 100% snags, not 100% catches. There's a demonstration for you. And I'll be demoing it, demoing it again for the other Poké Spots when something pops up there. Speaking of stuff popping up, here's a wild Zubat that literally appeared as soon as I stepped into Pyrite. I don't particularly care about catching this one either, but sure, why not? I'll give it a try. I'm gonna give it an honest effort. It's just if I get impatient. Who cares? Because I mean, I already have one overly fragile Pokemon on my team. I don't need another. Okay, basic summary. I accidentally somehow managed to delete the second half of the audio for this video. So, um, there's Zubat not being caught, unfortunately. So here's some post-commentary about 
the uh, very bipolar things that are happening in this video. Like, when I was recording it live, I didn't realize how bipolar and how cut up and how rapidly shifting that this, play this video is going to be. Uh, this video, more so than the next few videos, although the next few... Yes, it's a Swampert, I see it. Um, more so than the other future videos about this. Because this is a video in which I purify most of the Shadow Pokémon, still a couple Shadow Pokémon uh, next time. And also the one where the majority of the uh, Pokéspot stuff goes on. These guys, these dancer people, they were at the Krabby Club, and there's an interruption. Uh, they were performing at the Krabby Club way at the beginning of the game. I don't think I pointed that out, but it was kind of cool. Anyway, hi, there's a guy in the way. Let's go purify. So here we are with Relic Stone. You, you're probably sick of seeing this same scenario, but I will mix it up by using the Purify Chamber as well. Ho ho! See, I'm, I'm thinking about you. And at least you don't have to watch the tedious walking to and from. And of course, it's really fun when you uh, get right to the door of the Relic Stone and suddenly something appears on your Poké Spot and like, whoops, nope, nope, you can't come here. So anyway, their C dot is is kind of cool. Anyway, head off to the purify chamber because we've got things in the purify chamber. Yay! Now, uh, after every purification that I do in the chamber and uh, other relic stone, I mess with the uh, arrangement of the Pokemon a bit, add some to other sets, modify the other sets. Um, I don't show that because that's really tedious, but just keep in mind that I am doing that. So by the end of uh, the session, I'll have three relatively good loops going around. I don't think any of them are perfect. They're all lacking in flow, whatever that means. Yes, I know what it means, I'm just being artsy. Anyway, spinner rack is done. And I'm going to mess with the sets, but I don't show that. Mess with them. There we go. Anyway, here is uh, Pokemon at the final Poké Spot. Uh, this is the Pokemon that you can catch 36 of and totally cheese the Purify Chamber with. Very nice, very useful. A bit tedious to catch all of them, so I won't be doing that. Um, at least not at this point. The, my current uh, strategy has served me pretty well, so uh, I, I don't think I'll need to do that. Not that I don't try to catch this, but uh, unfortunately things don't go so well. If you couldn't guess from Zubat and Sand True, I kind of not very good at this whole catching thing when it, when stakes aren't involved. Yeah, critical, great, thanks, wonderful. Anywho, I am intent on catching something from a Poke Spot, and since I didn't put any snacks on the rock or cave Poke Spot, kind of want to put a snack here. Just to redeem myself, and also for one ulterior motive. But off we go, let's go purify things, yay! We actually don't go back to the lab at all in this video. Anyway, purifying Carvana, I think this is actually the last thing we do in this video. Hooray. Still doesn't look any less evil. Water Pulse. That reminds me, I need to teach that to uh, Rin. I have the TM thanks to Mount Battle. So I'll be doing that uh, episode 18. Let's take care of that. I will see you guys next time.